all right guys now that we have left that other spot because man the grass situation the debris and trash was just ah uh, yes it made it pretty much unfishable for us so i decided to go further down beach and we have pulled into about the 20s and it's some pretty serious 4x4 in over here uh, I made it through quite a bit of it in two-wheel drive but you got to keep going a certain pace and coming up on camps and stuff like that you cannot keep that same pace so that's why I did not you know you know you got to have four by four just safe play it safe do that so we came down further and here's the other thing too I kind of wish I had that other camera available but because I kept fishing with it and wasted out the battery I was unable to do so and in doing so it keeps me from being able to keep doing the test because over here I'm throwing the weights and they are immediately getting stuck except for the storm weight once again <laughs> but I wanted to see what it would look like over here because I mean the sand in this spot just us taking our footsteps we would drop down like two or three inches almost instantly just in our feet walking on that sand so you could actually see it right to the right side of me where I was walking out and casting out right before that little strip of water is on the beach and you can see our footsteps right through there and um, yes we got a little bit of seed when we got there but we've been here about 10-15 minutes and no major seaweed on the lines like when we pull them in so that's pretty good
Thank you.